Good afternoon. Welcome to our 389 FLC. First thing you'll notice is we have the uh, solid steps at the front. Right here is the control panel for your slides and your lights, your tank heaters. Over here, we have upgraded to the larger LCI leveler control system. And then right here are for the four Swintec slides. This does have six slides. Four of them are Swintec and two are rack and pinion. When you come in and go to the right, you come upon the kitchen. Um, this has a residential refrigerator, nice French doors. It has a full pantry with uh, storage underneath. As you can see, there's just a ton of uh, storage right here. It's got the single sink basin, and then obviously you have extra cabinet space. You got storage up there, cabinets down here, under sink, drawers, and then your stove here. A microwave and a range hood. And then behind us is the dinette. We only have the two chairs. Uh, the blinds are all the, the dark, dark out blinds, so those are great. Uh, when you come up into the living room with the 389 model, you've got two couches, one on each side, and then you have two power recliners. We've had covers on these seats the entire time we've owned them. They work in their, they're in perfect shape. Uh, this model does have carpet in it. Uh, if you look to the front, I'm sorry, the couches fold out, both of them will fold out to queen size beds. So this model will sleep up to six people. The front of it is the TV, the fireplace, and there's just a ton of storage around it. There's even some storage behind the television. You do have the Connex Bluetooth sound system, and then the storage behind the TV. Just tons of storage in here. It's on both sides of the TV. And then if we turn around, there's a little bit of storage behind the chair power recliners. Just awesome. And then we'll go back down the stairs through the kitchen. Once I'm gonna pause in the kitchen. We did upgrade to the micro easy touch RV thermostat. It allows you to control your heating and cooling from an app on your phone or right there. Now we go to the back of the camper. This takes you to the bathroom and the master bedroom. Uh, this model does come uh, fully equipped with two, a double vanity and they're porcelain. So that's wonderful. You have a lot of storage around your, your um, your sink, so that's great. And then you have a uh, three medicine cabinets, so just a bunch of storage up here. It's got a wonderful walk-in shower with a bench, and it's got a nice porcelain toilet, just in wonderful shape. We've always kept lube around there, so you got no worries. There's storage right right over your head by the toilet. And then there's actually storage behind the door. So there's plenty of room for all your toiletries and, and towels and linen. And then you do have a door that takes you to your master bedroom. Uh, we did upgrade from the RV mattress to this Lucid 10 inch gel memory foam. We've always had a, a cover on it. I've never slept with anything but a nice cover on it. And then we have massive storage underneath here. What's great about this is this is aluminum frame that's not wood. This will never fall apart on you. Okay, over here, right by the, the head of the bed, there is some more storage. If you have anything that you need to sleep with, CPAPs or anything, you have plenty of storage, and you even have an outlet right there. These are touch lights, so if you ever need to get out of bed in the middle of the night, you just tap that button. This door, so if you need some privacy, you know, when you're sleeping, you got people sleeping up front, you can close this, and it's a magnet that just holds that shut. As you can see, the door's in great shape. Um, 
This is a dresser. It's got two different sides of cabinets, which is plenty of storage there. But it also has three separate drawers for all your socks and stuff. It's just wonderful. The, the camper didn't come with a TV. We, we went ahead and got the mount and got it hung and everything. We're just going to leave it there because it, it put holes in there. We don't have to worry about it. Uh, this is not your main closet. It can be used as a closet, but also it's plumbed for a washer and dryer. And then next to that is a walk-in closet. Plenty of hanging space or even floor space to set things in. This is a queen bed. Um, we opted for that just so you have more space to walk besides it. Uh, I'm sure it wouldn't be that hard to upgrade it to a king bed if you wanted to. But that in a nutshell, well, now we'll go outside. I'm sorry, we'll move outside to check out the, all the great storage underneath it. Follow me. I have upgraded all the slam or all the latches to slam latches. Uh, this just has a, a ton of storage under here. I don't know if that light helps you, but there's even a TV hookup if you ever want to put a TV in there. Uh, we've had two kayaks under here, grills. There's just a ton of storage. It's even heated under here, so you don't have to worry about. Uh, it's actually air conditioned and heated, so you do not have to worry about stuff going bad under here. The slam latches are great. You just slam them and they're shut, but you've got plenty of ways to get into your basement. You got one, two, three doors just on this side. And then you have a, a wider one here on the back. You've got your ladder. Uh, the roof has always been uh, clean, inspected. And then if ever uh, any type of uh, self-leveling that needs to be applied, I'd make sure to get that on there right away. Right here, this is also in your basement, is your water works bay. Uh, you've got all your controls, you got a sprayer, and then you got your, your black tank and your one of your gray tanks right here, and a in you know in-house water filter. Uh, it does have the six-point hydraulic leveling. The hydraulic leveling system works great. The tires are in really good shape. It does have six slide outs. Four of them are Swintech with the, the ratchet type gears. And then the two in the middle, the kitchen slide out and the dinette are the rack and pinion type. There's storage up front. This is where your converter, it, inverter, and then where your auto leveling is kept. This model has two 30 pound tanks. You've got your storage up front. Uh, we did upgrade from the standard battery to the plat Duracell Platinum AGM batteries. They're maintenance free. They're awesome batteries. We added the snap pads to all the feet. Those are really nice. And then we ended up going ahead and upgrading the pin box to the more ride system. Uh, it, it's really nice. It's take out, takes out a lot of chucking and noise. But it, this model does have six slides. It's 42 feet long. Uh, we hate to sell it. Uh, we just plan to, um, you know, buy something up in the mountains in North Carolina. Um, if you are interested, please call 252-764-7935. Thank you and have a wonderful day.